everybody it is december 29th it is tuesday it is winter break um i kind of promised you guys that i would try to do like daily vlogs over my break but i didn't realize just how much i would be uh sitting on the couch so yesterday i literally was moving from the bed to the couch to the refrigerator back to the couch back to the bed just like rotating through my video games and the various shows like our bedroom has the ps3 but the living room has the ps4 so just depending on what i was in the mood to be watching or playing so i did absolutely nothing productive yesterday today i have to go to the dentist though so that kind of made me get up and not be a degenerate i have to be a good member of society today uh, my dentist appointment is at one so i'm gonna hit up target again i'm looking for those little tiered trays that people have been like obsessing over um, i'll just insert a couple pictures here so there's like the wooden variation and then like the heart one i would like the white metal one and then the wooden one i would put the white metal one in my bathroom and then the wooden ones either around my kitchen or in my bedroom so that's just like what i'm hoping to find i also was trying to do a pickup today order with walmart for some potting mix um i kind of expected that it would be out of stock and it said it's out of stock so that's kind of disappointing because that's literally all i wanted because i want to replant my succulents it's negative 10 here in wisconsin there's not a lot of potting soil to be found and when you do find potting soil it's just like for regular plants and i need the special kind that's for succulents and cactuses so i really don't know what i'm going to do about that but i'm just going to focus on getting myself to target and tj maxx looking for those trays and then if i have time i think there's a little local garden center around there somewhere that I might try, but I've never been there before. So I have absolutely no idea what they even carry, but maybe they have what I need. And then I will just come home, brush my teeth. Cause obviously if I'm at Starbucks, I've been having a coffee and then I'll go to my dentist. And then I don't know what I'll get up to after that. So I will see you guys when we get to Target. <laughs> so jealous of people that have multiple targets near them because I just have this one and then the next target is like an hour away so I can't like go looking at other targets for the what I need so just have to come back later this week I guess I love Valentine's Day it's such an aesthetically pleasing holiday like that is so cute those are so cute these so cute we have cupcake pans but it's disgusting i'm gonna throw it and get this new one it's so cute so kind of a boring target run and they were out of the toasted white mocha so i had to get just the regular mocha frappuccino i mean it's good but it's just not the same and then i also got a brownie so yeah exactly what you should be eating for breakfast on the day you go to the dentist I used to go to a pediatric dentist, obviously, till I was like 18. And then I had to switch over to like an adult dentist. At that dentist, you would brush your teeth before you were seen. And now at my adult dentist, you just go in and hopefully you brush your teeth before. So good. <laughs> that brownie wrapper looks disgusting. Um, my backup camera has a bunch of salt on it. So I've got chocolate on my hands, great. So I stopped in the TJ Maxx really quick because I just had a little bit of time before I could do lunch. I got this little tweezer carry set for $4. A little cactus lip balm that's birthday cake flavored. It's lime green champion cropped tank top for $8. If there's a TJ Maxx near you, highly recommend it because this is their like big clearance time where they're clearancing out all the sweaters and gift sets and stuff and getting ready for all of the warm spring summer clothing i mean even in wisconsin all the sweaters and coats are on clearance but it's gonna be winter here for several more months but oh well i'm gonna head home and grab some taco bell for lunch coffee brownie taco bell before the dentist we are just living life i'm one of those people that like to tempt fate by eating in bed got my cheesy gordita crunch couple napkins on my lap just in case we have 20 minutes till i have to go to the dentist so i need to hurry up and eat this and brush my teeth again It feels so weird brushing my teeth after lunch because that's something I never do.
half hour later, we are cavity free. My little hygienist lady was like, nice job like usual, but remember to floss. And you know, that's what they tell you every time. Remember to floss and do you floss? Well, maybe about once a week when I eat popcorn or something gets stuck. So probably since I switched over to this dentist, since I went to a pediatric dentist, I've always done my appointments in December over Christmas break and then July just over summer break. So then I don't have to worry about doing it in the beginning of the year. When I was at the pediatric dentist, they always did like a fluoride treatment on you. And after the fluoride treatment, you can't eat for like a half hour. But now that I'm an adult, they only do like a polish. And so you can eat right after that. <laughs> so I was like, thanks for your hard work. I'm gonna go get some coffee and ruin it. When you go to the dentist, you have the same um, like hygienist cleaning lady every time. So like me personally, so when I switched over from the pediatric dentist to my adult dentist, still let's see, I'm 24. So that's like five years ago. I've had the same lady, which not that I remember what life was like exactly when I was 18 at the pediatric dentist, but I'm pretty sure I never had the same hygienist every single time. It kind of reminds me of like, butterscotch candy so it's basically just chicken and lemon papa seed dress we got cranberries and then pine nuts oh your life is so hard yes my boyfriend was weighing a ham so that's why there's a scale here are you wanting something okay Oh my goodness. I got these sheets last week at TJ Maxx. So of course I put them on the bed. Christmas, even though it, Christmas is over. I'm going to eat my salad, drink my iced coffee. And then I'm going to film my what I got for Christmas video because I've been needing to do it for several days now and I just haven't gotten around to doing it. Good morning. As you can see, we still haven't found a place for my mirror yet. It's just chilling on the floor where I left it when I was filming my video, but I thought I would show you my outfit of the day. So we've got these lovely tie-dye purple pink leggings. They are from Walmart. They're like $15, super cool, and they have pockets on both sides. Big fan of that. And then I have my... They're called like Nebula Hunter boots. Um, kind of reminds me of like a holographic purple. And then I'm wearing a purple champion shirt that I got from TJ Maxx, but I also found it on Amazon. So if you're interested in the pants or the shirt, I linked it down below my description, just in case you're interested. And then I have a fuzzy black North Face on. It's almost nine o'clock and normally nine o'clock on winter break, I'm still in bed, but it snowed a bunch last night and my apartment complex makes us be out for a significant amount of time so they can plow. They just go around to the various um, complex that they own in the area so like today we have to be out from 9 a.m to 5 p.m but if i like drive by at noon and they've already plowed then we can come back and park normally it's not a big deal because i'm at work or something but it's always like my days off for the weekends it seems that it snows a lot and then i have to find something to do with my car there's a church next door that you can park in sometimes they also sometimes tow cars too because they don't want people that don't belong there in their lot so it's kind of hard during the winter to find some place for your car to go I probably had enough footage yesterday that I could have made a standalone vlog, but I had my what I got for Christmas slash Gabe video going up and it took two hours the first time, then it failed. And then it took five hours to fully upload to YouTube. And it was like a 15 minute video, I think. So I have absolutely no idea why a 15 minute video took five hours, but yeah, safe to say uh, Tuesday's footage was not gonna go up because I like to make sure that the entire footage is edited and uploaded and I can watch it first before I delete it and start over with something new. So yes, here we are continuing on. It is Wednesday, December 30th. We're gonna hit up a couple of the dollar stores and then we're just gonna go back to Target and get a coffee because we need something to do with our lives. I might go to my parents if I come back here around lunchtime and they still haven't plowed, but normally our apartment complex is plowed around noon. So that's my hope that I come back around lunchtime and it's all plowed out and ready for me to park again. But we do have school things we need to work on and we do have our succulents we need to plant. So, so let's go outside and see how much snow we got. It's honestly not that bad, like three inches. The worst part is it's ice underneath and it's like caked on, so that's fun. I was not planning on getting Starbucks until I went to Target, but I just went by a Starbucks with only one car in the drive through so that's like a sign. Um, I'm kind of cold, so I feel like I want a hot drink, but I also don't know what I want. I guess that's the bad thing about being like literally the only person in the drive through is if you don't know what you want, um, they're just gonna ask you right away, and I'm not, I don't know what I want. I guess I could try the hot of the holiday drink I haven't had yet, which is the... Hi, welcome to Starbucks. My name is Izzy. How are you doing today? I'm doing good. That is so good to hear. Can I get started for you? Can I get a venti hot of the caramel brulee latte? Do you have the egg bites? 
Uh, yeah, we sure do. What kind did you like? I'll do the bacon ones. Sure thing. Like the quickest Starbucks drive through experience I've had in a long time. I've eaten my egg bites. I'm ready to go into the lovely Dollar Tree and I've realized I forgot the gift that I was gonna mail. Which is literally the only reason that I have to go to this side of town anyways. Now I have to come again. So I'm hoping to find the silicone ice trays. I'd like to have four. So for my first graders, I'd like them to have two for each kid, so four. And then my third graders are working on counting by 10. So I'd like to be able to put like a dime in each section of the 10 ice tray so that they could count 10 so that I'm getting use out of just four trays. But I need five because I want one for myself because I would like cute ice cubes in my coffee. Let's go inside and see what we can see. I have erasers left from last year, so I don't need more erasers, but if something super cute and decorative strikes out at me, I could perhaps get it since at this point in time, we will be in person for Valentine's Day. Will it still happen? I don't know, but Valentine's Day is a cute holiday and the decorations can be used year round. So, as usual, didn't find what I need, but found plenty of stuff I didn't come for. I got a whole bag full of stuff for $6.33. So I got these pom-poms for $0.50. Cents. I use these all the time. Pencils for $0.50. Cents. I believe these are the ones where it's like actual wood and it doesn't have the paper wrapper. I uh, hate the paper wrapper pencils, and that's like what Target has. Hate, hate, hate. I got two of these really cute uh, foam heart stickers from when you make Valentine's. They say like love you and best friend and that sort of thing. Four packages of these. These are 50 cent eraser toppers like Santas and reindeers, Christmas trees, that sort of thing. And then I got three coloring books, two Star Wars ones, and then just a like Santa one. I don't necessarily use the coloring page portions. I like the crosswords and word finds that they have in there. It's so annoying that you have to put the mask on first and then you can put on the hat because that's just not something I'm ever used to because I normally don't wear a hat but it is a bit chilly out and my hair is a little frozen. Okay we are at Target right now. We're gonna go in hope that the Valentine's Day stuff we want is out but probably it will not be and Can I have a Trenta? Do you have Trentas here? Yep. Okay, I'll do a Trenta pink drink with light ice. Why do I need an ice drink when it's 20 degrees out? I don't know. I'm freezing. I'm so excited that I found the heart metal trays. Now I'm just on the lookout for the wooden tiered trays that are kind of like it. But one of my friends worked at Target and he was stocking the dollar spot when I was there. So I was like, hey, Nick, if you see this, let me know. He's like, okay, I'll text you, dude. So perfect. He said the cart that he was unloading was the only one they had. So unless they got stuff tonight, they didn't have it. So I guess I'll just have to patiently wait and hope that they come on the day he's working and he sees them. I know for sure I want one in my bathroom. Maybe I want the other in my bathroom. I'm sure my boyfriend will really appreciate hearts in the bathroom, but I have a plan in my head and I'm excited to go home and do a little organization. But first it's 11 o'clock. It's kind of lunchtime. I'm feeling like McDonald's. So I'm gonna grab McDonald's on my way home and then I will catch you guys inside. Also, I'm not gonna do a haul because I really didn't get that much um, except for stuff from the dollar spot. So here's a picture of what I got. Basically just heart pillow and then those trays, uh, some little succulent plants that I'm gonna put in my little succulent pot when I pot it tomorrow, I think. And then I also got some Drano because our shower drain is not draining and that's probably me and all my hair. So I'll catch you guys at home. What do you think, Shay Shay? Are we ready to organize? This is her new favorite blanket. I got it 50% off at Walmart and she loves it. We love a good clearance Christmas blanket. Okay, so here's the current state of the bathroom. Um, most of the junk is literally just mine. Here's the two trays I'm going to be using. I'm thinking one will go over there and one for like the toothbrush stuff. I guess I'm not quite sure. And then I'm going to give it all a good clean, get rid of the toothpaste stains and all of that stuff. So I'll show you guys when it's all done and clean. So we got everything cleaned off. Just have to actually clean it. I'm doing a little eye gel, I guess you could say, treatment. It's from that 
Peter Thomas Roth set I got. I've never tried this sort of thing before, but I guess it feels nice. I don't know if I would repurchase just because my under eyes is not an area I've ever cared about, but hey, whatever. I put my hair dryer and my hair straightener in this spare closet, which is mostly just filled with my junk. Because honestly, I don't see myself straightening my hair or using that hair dryer again until we don't have to wear a mask. So it can just stay in there, except for the rare occasion that I feel like using it. <gasps> Me trying to get a thumbnail, like, hello like my selfie stick. To me, that is so cute. Um, unfortunately, this right here, I think is gonna be a permanent like stain. Like I chipped the paint off the counter or something. Cause when this is going, it kind of like rocks back and forth. I mean, if, if you saw my last video, you saw it running. On this side, we just have the toothbrush stuff, a mouthwash, all the toothpaste we have open, which is three right now, the flossies, and then my makeup brushes. It looks pretty darn good to me. So I'm just gonna end this video right here. I might have to go to Walmart later tonight. We're out of strawberries and I really wanted to make a smoothie or I wanted to make some sort of banana muffin. And I know we don't have all the ingredients for that. And I used the last bit of the bathroom cleaner so we could use some more of that. And I'd like this video to go up in a decent amount of time. And if it's like the last video and it takes five hours, well, we're gonna be waiting a while. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. I think tomorrow will be succulent planting day. So make sure you come back for that. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.